Hey guys, this is Steve from Trim That Weed, and welcome to our comparison video of single pole versus double pole thermostats. Watch until the end to unravel which thermostat you should choose. So, the main difference between a single pole and a double pole thermostat is the offsetting. A double pole thermostat has a true offsetting that keeps the heater off regardless of how low the air temperature will drop. On the other hand, the single pole thermostat does not have an offsetting but instead relies on a minimum temperature setting as its offsetting. With such a setup, heaters will automatically turn on whenever the air temperatures fall below the designated minimum temperature per the thermostat's specifications. Different brands have varied minimum temperature specifications for the single pole thermostat, often between 40 to 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Therefore, double pole thermostats are more effective in turning the heater off. Connection The single pole thermostat only consists of two wires at its rear side, a line and a load. The line supplies the thermostat with power, while the load supplies the power to the heater after going through the thermostat. On the contrary, double pole thermostats consist of four wires, two loads, and two lines. The dual line connection of the double pole thermostat makes on and off switching possible. Therefore, the double pole thermostat is more complex but effective in controlling the heater. Safety Using single pole thermostats might result in unanticipated heater related accidents, considering that heaters will automatically turn on when temperatures fall below the specified minimum level. Accidents are prone, especially when items are placed directly on the heater or close to them. On the other hand, a double pole thermostat ensures impeccable safety, as the heater will never turn on unless you switch it on. Double pole thermostats are therefore safer to use. Comparison table This comparison table shows you that you can regulate your heater's energy consumption with the double pole thermostat just by completely switching it off, something impossible to do with the single pole thermostats. Similarity Both the single and double pole thermostats fall under line voltage thermostats. The voltage adjustment mechanism allows for regulating heat intensities of convection, radiant, or resistance heaters. Verdict So which one is better? The double pole thermostat outsmarts its single pole counterpart in almost every aspect. Unless you intend to have your heater automatically turn on when temperatures critically fall, the double pole thermostat is your better option. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know which other comparisons you'd like to see next from us.